Well, the season's winding down here in Utah, and you can see, you know, what's happening up on the mountains, getting lots of snow. We've had a few dustings down here in the valley, but, you know, not enough to keep us off the course yet. So today, I'm trying to, uh, you know, I took three clubs out of the bag. So I'm bringing just 11. I left my three wood, my three iron, and my lob wedge at home. So I figured, let's go ahead, take some of the harder clubs out of the bag, just keep it easy. Um, I'm walking 18 today with the bag, so it'll, it'll lighten the load as well. But, you know, sometimes you can improve just by avoiding the clubs you, you suck with. So we'll see how that goes today, and uh, I'll try to get a full vlog in for you. All right, thanks, everybody. So just a really quick sidebar, I had 240 yards in on that par five. Um, you know, I only have the four iron and then the four wood today. So it was, it's playing downwind, there's probably 10 miles an hour of wind, you know, straight down. So the four wood easily could have gone long. And uh, even though the four iron didn't seem like it was quite enough, it's just short is often better than long. So I also had a really tight lie. You might be able to see that on camera. It's, it's, it was really barren, no grass there. And I just felt the four iron would be easier. Luckily, I pulled it off, hit it really well. I'll try to give you a peek here. I was able to run it just onto the front of this green, and I have a little eagle putt, so it paid off. But, you know, anyway, um, if you don't have the perfect club, if there's no danger short, and you have a, a green like this is that sloped back to front, just play short, no problem. You know, if you don't get there, you chip on and, and putt. So, here we go. Let's see if I can make a, an eagle. I think it probably showed up on camera, but I hit a little blade fade there. Um, so it went right to the green. It hit this cart path. Uh, so I'm trying to figure out where it went. Uh, yeah, you know, as long as I can find it, I can uh, hopefully, oh, there it is. Way back here. Got quite a bit of work. Um, but hopefully I can make, you know, you hope for a bogey. If I make a miracle par, that's great.
All right, my four would almost reach the green here. I just have a chip. Um, look at that lie. Isn't that just beautiful? Um, I'm not sure what's going on there. <clears throat> I don't know actually if I'm technically able to move that, but uh, I think we'll just play it as is. Let's try to bump it out, get on the green, see if I can uh, have a birdie chance. I almost missed that. Okay, well, it was down breeze, so I hit a seven iron. Even though it's chilly, there's there's been so much breeze today. I thought it'd go, thought it'd go. Um, but I came up short. I'm right down there. Um, so yeah, it's gonna be pretty difficult. Um, again, it's one of those situations. I just, I just want to get it out, get it on the green. I'll be really happy with a bogey. So let's see what I can do. So I got down in that hazard, and I just had to take a drop. I wasn't, I wasn't gonna get it out, especially with the 54. Um, you know, and then uh, chunked the chip, and finally got on in four shots and two putted. So a little triple. Golf is just brutal, you know. You can be playing well, and something like that happens. Oh well, you know, we're not professionals, so you just keep grinding and. Got a couple easy holes coming in here, so hopefully I can play better.
pay good money to do this. You know, I, I took time out of my day and paid money to be here. I don't know why we do it. Anyway, I was one under through five. Now I'm four over through seven. So, you know, that's just how it goes. I'm sure a little par three here and then going back into the wind. Number 18 is a, a long par five. It's going to be three shots today. So, all right, let's finish good here. Alright, good drive, right up the left edge. I just hit a punch four iron to lay up and it was, it was actually a really well struck shot. I was really excited. I come back to the camera, it's not running. So, I hit the photo button instead of the video button on that one. So, uh, you'll just have to believe me, it was a beautiful layup. You'd be amazed. Anyway, I probably have a little wedge in to the par five. Then we circle around to the front nine. Alright, here we go.